of course, Pinky Winston. <laughs> Hi, baby girl. Come on. Okay, so, anyway, um, I was just thinking about, you know, that whole, you know, I'm not into politics, like, I don't vote or anything. timing is always so perfect. Pinky, stop, 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 stop. Um, I don't vote because I personally don't believe in the system. I think it's, I don't think anything we do actually matters, honestly. Um, it doesn't seem like it. <laughs> I don't know, maybe it's just that, you know, the people that would do good aren't doing good because they're not doing bad first. And I think that I don't know. I'm starting to wonder about this world. Like, I get this sort of distinct feeling that it might be hell. <laughs> because it seems like no matter what you do, you know, good doesn't win here. It's like the most, everyone, the most corrupt people in the world are doing the best. And it just seems to be the, the way it goes. It's like, like Hollywood. And, you know, I've said this about YouTube. It's kind of like Hollywood is the place for, you know, that's like the big league soul selling zone. And then YouTube is like, you know, small fry soul selling zone. And you see it a lot, you know, and people might think, oh, it's not, but it essentially is because when, when people go against what they know is right, I believe that is all it takes to truly sell your soul. And, um, you know, I don't know. You see it so much. I don't know. I was thinking earlier about how, uh, how the the elite <laughs> you know i mean when you go through youtube and you read some of the comments and you see that people they just don't i don't know they're not very smart you know they're it's not even about not being smart it's about they don't have standards you know like it's like there's no standard you know like there's a channel who uploads like footage from an, a news site and they never show themselves they never speak nobody knows like who they are male or female, American or foreigner, it doesn't, nobody knows. No one has any idea. They just, the text, <laughs> whatever they write. And everybody was on there. They posted a video of uh, just driving down the road. <laughs> Said they were going to the Trump rally or something. And it, no, I mean, it was like grainy night footage. And everybody was like, oh, thank you so much. You're the best. You're the best. Oh, where can I donate money? Where can I do this? You know, bless you. Godspeed give them hell, blah, blah, blah. And I was just reading and I was like, how is it that a, like a, a seven minute video of grainy nighttime footage can garner, excuse me, garner so much praise from people just, <laughs> and I was like, wow. You know, and then I think about the elites and I'm like, it's no wonder that they don't really have any respect for people because the one thing that the internet has done is, it, is it, it's given a window and it's really just condensed people because when you go online and you put whatever you write, that's about the best of you. You know what I mean? Or it should be anyway. And I don't know. That's why, you know, nobody wants to read anything, you know, like, oh, that's too long. I'm not reading that. And I'm like, the intelligence levels of humanity are just free falling. Like they're gone. It's over. Like, I'm serious. I really think that it's just over now. <laughs> You know, and I hate to be so pessimistic, but it's like, you know, maybe you just have to just, you know, grin and bear it. <laughs> because, like, what the hell's the point? You know, what, what, what is the point of being miserable about it? Because it's just, it always goes this way. It's no matter what, the, the, the worst of humanity always seems to win. I mean, Raphael Warnock, like, really what a creepy creepy like who the hell votes for these people like i don't know that's why i keep saying you know like i see the, a high potential for um like strongholds to start taking place because you know if if i pretty much we're looking at a one-party system like the, the the lunatic left they've won they've raised and you know they've fostered all these crazy people they've raised them through the internet and it's just gonna get worse i mean Nobody has hometown values. Nobody cares about what's right there. You know what I mean? It's all like... <laughs> my family sucks. You guys are my real family. You know what I mean? And that's just like the whole thing now. The 
That's all that matters to people. You know, and they grow up like this. So, you know, what are you going to do? Like, there's nothing for them to compare it to. There's no good old days. Like, remember when things were great? Nope. They came into this world being told everything was shit. And they were right. <laughs> it's just, uh, it's just been like a, like a cardboard background. That's all reality was. And it just got pushed over. And, um, I don't know. You know, and, and I was watching this other thing and it had these two, like, you know, the Republican Party is now the, you know, diverse, so many POCs and, and women and minorities, you know, got on the, you know, have gotten elected in. And I'm like, <laughs> you know what that means, right? That means that as soon as they start using that language, it's not going to be, there will be, Republicans will be like the independents. It'll be liberal and extreme left. <laughs> You know, that's basically it. It's going to be the Republican Party is going to be gone and it's just going to be down to liberals, which will be the previous Republicans, because that's basically what they are and extreme left. So <laughs> I don't know. I think it's just kind of over and it's going to be essentially a one party system. The only it's just going to keep splitting, but further to the left, because, you know, the left are the party of the crazy people, you know, I call them the trash collectors of society, they will accept literally anyone, no standards. And I think that we should, you know, like I said, political segregation, just do it, just fucking do it. Can we just separate, you know, it's not about skin color, obviously politically, se excuse me, segregating over skin color is insane. Segregating over intelligence levels is required, it's mandatory, it's necessary, it's highly desirable. <laughs> and I greatly encourage it because how how is it like if they're raising people to be mental those are the people that are voting there's no standards anybody that lives in this country anyone that's in this country can vote you know at this point so I don't know I think uh, I just think we should just get away from each other it's like being in a like trying to move like everybody moved into a mental institution with all the crazy fucks and we're just supposed to like well, they're people too. It's like, yeah, crazy people. I don't want to live under their fucking authority, their rule. Like, who does? Like, I don't know. That's, I just think that eventually, like, coming soon, there will be strongholds. People are going to say, you know, no way. You know, because they're going to destroy everything. <laughs> I'm pretty sure of it. I mean, just listen to the stuff they say. These people are nuts. It's not like they're going to get up there and go, you know, that might not be the best idea. Maybe we should reconsider. They're going to be like... Can I do it? I'll be the first one. First, 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 just like everybody on the fucking internet, they're first, you know, and then they wonder why politics are the same. It's like, because everybody, that's all everybody's worried about. The world is social media. The world is a fucking digital. It's the WW world. Three W's in front of world. I mean, it's sad. It really is like truly social media and the internet has literally ruined reality, has ruined the earth. It has ruined humanity. It's over. And it's, you know, because of that. I don't care what anyone says. That's just the way it is. That's how I see it. It's clear as day. Anyway, <laughs> have a wonderful day. <laughs> I know that was pretty grim. Gloomy. But, you know, whatever. Bye. <laughs>